Hey guys, it's me, Nick, known as One of Films. Well, I'm finally doing it. I'm doing a criticism video on Switch Played again. And hopefully this will be the last time that I'm going to be criticizing this jagoff. So yeah, I'm going to be talking about the pronoun guy, who is also known as the biggest homophobe on the internet. And the biggest joke on the internet as well. So, yeah, Switch Played, he has done it again. He has made himself more of a complete jackass. You know, I don't know why I'm making these videos, because, honestly, I don't know if I should be able to, to expose Switch Play at all, because he's exposing himself, honestly. And whenever people are clowning and doxing him, all he does is reply that they're just either bots or spams or something like that, or trolls. And yeah, and now he's saying that he has too much pride. Too much pride? More like too much stupidity. Because dude, it takes a bigger man to admit when they're wrong. But you, Switchblade, you're definitely not the big biggest man here. Not at all. You are a big coward and a big gigantic pussy. You just cannot, like, have the decency of admitting when you're wrong. Because, hell, I, I, I'm, I sometimes admit when I'm wrong, or if I do something stupid. Like, I admit when I'm wrong. But when do you switch play? When do you admit when you're wrong? Hmm, let me think. When was the time? Hmm. Oh, I know. Neither. Because you're still a gigantic, egotistic asshole. And of course, Switchplate is still being a body shaming asshole because, of course, he's making more fat jokes of me. <phone rings> hmm? Huh. What's this? Oh, hello. Hmm. Okay. Okay. Alright, I'll tell him that. Thank you. That was Dean from YouTube, Switch Played. He called and he wants his fat jokes back. Because that's how unoriginal you are, Switch Played. You insult everyone and claim that they're bots and trolls, even though that you don't have any proof whatsoever. People are doxing and making fun of you and clowning you for making a stupid, a stupid statement that you shouldn't have said. Because honestly, you've been harassing Nintendo and been harassing the goddamn voice actor of Mario as well. Just because you don't like pronouns that you're like, Oh no pronouns! They're gonna destroy the world! Oh god! We must destroy the pronouns or else the pronoun virus will spread! Please listen to me because I'm always right! Me, Switchblade, I'm always right and you all are wrong! Wrong, wrong, wrong! Subscribe to me! I'm better than all of you! Seriously, Switch played. Go touch some goddamn grass, you hypocritical, narcissistic prick. Like, my god, you are making yourself look bad even more. And to top off the cherry, oh boy. Okay, this tweet right here was basically. Okay. Switch played basically justified everything Hitler has done and basically compared him to Biden. Okay. Wow. Um, all right. So, yeah. Switchblade is going this far that he is justifying the literal holocaust and genocide that Hitler has caused during the past and and the amount of lives he's taken to Biden the old fossil himself I don't I don't like Biden or anything like that I don't care about Biden or politics but what the fuck Switch played, he is still thinking that he's in the right. Like, he thinks that he's the victim here whenever people are clowning him, but in reality, he is just making himself look like a, a complete, utter dumbass. 
And this is the reason why, because, oh my god, literally this man, it, he's, he does not have any pride at all. He has pure stupidity inside of him. And stubbornness. Literally Switch played, he is the biggest moron on the internet, and he is this stubborn. Because he thinks all of his goddamn shitty, unvalid statements are facts, but in reality, they're not. They're just his opinion, which no one cares about or wants to hear it. And this is the same twat that likes and retweets homophobic tweets. Yeah, of course you're that type of person. All LGBTQ communities are pedophiles and predators. They're the source of all of it. You know, not all LGBTQ are, you know, pedos. Like, okay, what about Republicans or churches? Because they have, they have pedophiles as well. And pedophilia has been around way before the LGBTQ community has been around. So, yeah. And you and everyone else is acting like the LGBTQ community is the source of all, all pedophilia. Do you know how ridiculous that sounds? You sound insane just like this person right here. Yeah, this is why no one respects politicians or, or religions anymore. Because of this. Because, honestly, have you ever thought that not all of these communities are bad? Like, for example, people thought that the, that the whole entire furry community is full of, full of zoophiles. But actually, no, the furry community is actually against zoophiles. They even report and block zoophiles. And even artists are against people that trace art or make fetish art. So yeah, artists, they're against that as well. So yeah, not all communities are the same. Have you ever thought of that, Switch Played? Yeah, I don't think so, because you're too busy sticking more sticks up your ass. Because it shouldn't be the LGBTQ community you should be going after for, or hating, or, or lashing out at. It's, you know, pedophilia that you should hate and despise. Because pedophilia is everywhere, for crying out loud. It can happen anywhere. Not only the LGBTQ community. Like I said, Republicans and even churches and everywhere have pedophiles. No joke. And even, okay, even the whole entire sports and football community even has some pedophiles as well. But luckily, they're aware of that. And football fans, they... They, they definitely don't allow pedophiles either. So yeah, again, Switch Played, you are jumping into conclusions at this point. Because, honestly, freedom of speech. Freedom of speech can be for anyone, but not everyone. And you, Switch Played, you definitely shown us that, that freedom of speech is not for you at all. And get this, he's also a supporter of that Oompa Loompa looking ass Donald Trump as well. So yeah, no wonder why Switch Played always has his head up his own ass, because he always brings up politics. How surprising. And it feels like that he's bringing politics to Mario as well. Because apparently the LGBTQ and even pronouns are not welcome. Well, guess what, Switch Played? What does pronouns and the LGBTQ have to do with anything? Like, like they're not the same. Pronouns are showing people's genders. That's it. Like, everyone has goddamn pronouns, you fucking twat. Just say that you're a homophobe and you're wrong about everything and you're an utter dumbass that likes to dick ride Donald Trump so this could all be over with, okay? Just just admit it already, Switch Played. 
You're making yourself look like a fool, and people are rightfully clowning you for the bullshit you have, you have done and said. And even someone rightfully called you out for ruining this country as well. And honestly, I agree with this person. People like you, Switchblade, is ruining this country. Because why even treat people like an outcast and treat the LGBTQ community differently and just be a sort, like, just act like a tantrum man-child towards people with pronouns? And even you claiming what you said is the truth, even though that you got no proof at all. Meanwhile, someone has called you out for, for making this country look bad. And let's be honest, you are making this country look bad. You are ruining this country, Switchblade, because people like you is the reason why this country is falling apart and why this country is becoming toxic and poisonous. Because you treat people like an outcast. And if people have pronouns or if people are part of the LGBTQ community, you just lash out at them and insult them. And you're using politics as an excuse to avoid people calling you out as well. Yeah, honestly, Switchblade, you deserve to be clowned and you deserve to be doxxed. You know what? People are right. Please delete your account, Switchplay. Just delete your Twitter account, honestly. Because you are making yourself look bad, and you're just making America look bad as well. And you're making the whole entire Mario community look bad as well, because for real, again, yeah, you don't know anything about Mario at all because you're a fake Nintendo fan. That's what you are. You're a fake Nintendo fan. Because get this. Mario is tolerant. He'll accept anyone or anything at face value. He treats anyone and anything with dignity and respect. He has seen too many things in his travels to be narrow-minded. So, yeah, even Mario has more love and more value and care than you, Switch played. You don't know anything about this because you're a fake Nintendo fan because all you do is shove your own head up Donald Trump's ass all day long. And this is why I hate politics, people. Yep, this is why I hate politics and I don't want anything to do with it. And Republicans and Democrats, they could go screw themselves. Because seeing how toxic these people can be about politics, yeah, honest to God, this is why I hate politics, and I don't give any shits about it, or anything like that. I don't give a shit about the presidents, or anything like that. Because if the presidents are not good presidents at all, I'm not going to vote any of them at all. I'm just going to wait for the next couple years, you know, for an election for a better president that won't cause this much problems to our country. Because all the Biden supporters and Donald Trump supporters, they could go fuck themselves with a pair of scissors for all I care. And for Switchblade, please just stay out of Twitter and stay out of the Nintendo community until you fix yourself, okay? Because you acting like this is not going to make you a better person at all. Because you lashing out at people and just insulting them just because they're different in this world just really shows that you don't care or give a shit about people at all. Because you're nothing but a selfish, egotistic jackass that thinks that everything you're saying is right, but clearly everything you're saying is making you look like a complete joke. So yeah, Switchblade, you should just go back to living at the circus, because honestly, that is the only thing that you're good at, is making yourself look like a goddamn clown. So grow up, Switchblade. So, yeah. This is basically what I think about this situation with Switchblade, and it's gotten far way worse than I thought. Yep. Switchblade has really shown the worst in him. And honestly, God, if anyone who subscribes to Switchblade, honestly, I would not even bother supporting him. Because Switchblade, he has shown that he is not a good person at all. Like, this dude is a toxic, egotistic 
asshole is what he is. Like, he has shown himself that, that he is not good with people or good with, with politics or anything like that. And he is definitely making America look bad. Because if he's an American citizen, yeah, he is definitely just, he's, he's literally the poison and cancer to America itself. And I would just stay away from him. That's what I would just say. If any of you don't know who Switch Play is, I would just stay away from him and just don't go to his, his channel or his Twitter account or else this guy will just, you know, see your pronouns and he'll insult you and just cry about it. So yeah, that's basically my video about this and basically, yeah, I hope you guys enjoy this video and basically, yeah, more videos will be coming out in 2024 and I'll see you guys next time and goodbye.